Hey there lads and ladies, it is Petrifying Pumpkins here and today I have got like a news type roundup thing going on, that's the new show I guess. Uh, in the news this week we've got Firewall's one year anniversary, I'm sure you already know about that if you've been following this channel, but to commemorate the occasion, First Contact Entertainment are having a free trial week, so this runs from the 28th of august all the way up until the 2nd of september so that's like six days something like that and during this time you're going to have the free trial plus you're going to have double xp so you got a reason to come back if you already have us and you got a reason to try it out if you don't have us so definitely check that out we also have confirmation of Spire one is coming in september the 24th to be exact the game will be available to pre-order on the PlayStation Store on the 30th of August and if you do so, you will get a 15% discount on the game. You can also pre-order the game on PC, on Steam right now and if you do that, you'll get a free copy of Killing Floor Incursion which also comes from the publisher Trip Floor, Tripwire Interactive. Tripwire Interactive. So for those of you looking forward to Aspire 1, which looks like a blend between Metal Gear Solid and GoldenEye 007, then definitely keep your calendars marked 30th of August, pre-orders go live, 24th of September, you can buy the game. Dream Match Tennis VR is a game that was already out, like last year or something like that, and it was noticeable for being one of the few games that let you use the uh, PlayStation Move Navigation Controller. Now that one is getting a free multiplayer update and that is coming on the 10th of september so very soon and that's going to be a free update if you already own the game so look forward to that i might actually grab that game now as soon as it's got a multiplayer update and finally we got news about arizona sunshine's the damned dlc which is to be their latest dlc added to the game that has been delayed it was due to release already uh which i completely forgotten all about but now it's been pushed back because it needs extra polish or something like that. Now the developers Vertigo Games have not given us a new date to go by. They've only told us that the game is coming to PC VR and PS VR soon. So if you're looking forward to that, just keep your eyes peeled for an announcement on a release date. And that's it for this news this week. We'll have another episode of Touch and Tips up later on this week where we will go into more details about these topics plus topics that wouldn't fit in a new show like this so yeah look forward to this and i will see you lads and ladies later goodbye